goes away first. Okay, this is the latest endorser. Oh, yeah. Work it. Yeah, all right. This is David. This is David. David, uh, strike another pose. Oh, yeah, you got my name now. Thank you so much. Now, we Okay. Thank you, David. All right. Yes, you did send me food. Yeah. How come? Is that your restaurant? Uh, that was your. Um, it was uh, my uh, healthy online business. Yes. You still remember? Yes. Is that still you still have it? Well. Uh, so I guess you're an entrepreneur, yeah. aside from you know being on on, on, on the line line and showbiz. How did you come about to um, you know come to being in your career in in, in on, on TV? Was that a, a long journey or did they find and look for you? I, I know you're in that um, Ibarra and Maria Clara. Yeah, yeah. Well, actually, um, showbiz was never in my plans before. Um, I was a basketball player. So, uh, at that moment, uh, I felt like basketball didn't love me back. <laughs> so, I looked for an alternative for me to, you know, like, put my energy. That's why I, that's why I got into acting. Was it like, uh, were you discovered or did you, um, you know, audition for the role? I started uh, modeling first. Oh, okay. uh, and then Mr. Chinatown and then... I met uh, my manager, Sia, yeah, Mr. Arlon Griffey. Yeah. See? I, you have to make me a star. <laughs> How nice. And then, um, did you have to do any special preparations for your role as, uh, on, on TV? I mean, on prime time? Yeah, I went on uh, workshops, as in uh, personal workshops. That I, got. So I, I, I paid for that myself. Yeah, all hard work. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that's good, that's good. Um, so does does not occupy your entire day? Like I asked Tracy, what is your day like? My day, uh, I start my day by uh, first thing I do is work out, and then afterwards um, I meditate, and then um, I try to read the book. Tapos, um, and I, kasi parang I I want to be in that Zen mode where you know like I'm I'm creative. So parang like when it comes to business, I have so many ideas that I can implement. For my businesses. Uh, well, talking about businesses, what businesses do you have aside from? Well, I'm I'm into uh, food and beverage. Oh, still. Business. So, yeah. but it's not anymore that healthy. No, yeah, not anymore. So I have one in uh, Murito Alaban. It's a Sobra Cafe. It's a what? It's Sobra Cafe. Okay. And then I have uh, Puyo Korea in uh, UP Town. So soon to be a franchising company. Oh, nice. And then I also have a construction company. So if ever you have anything, uh, no, I can... Uh... <laughs> uh, yes, you can come to my house. <laughs> how nice that you have actually diversified. Um, how do you keep everything balanced? It seems like you just have uh, so much work on your plate right now. Yeah, that's why you know, uh, sometimes uh, I, look, I look super tired. That's why, that's why I go to uh, the water days, but yeah. you know. <laughs> Relax. Yes. Do you actually incorporate that in your schedule? What is your favorite treatment? Favorite treatment is uh, Balinese spa. Oh, also? Massage, yeah. Like, Miss Mary. Mary. Um, since I'm always working out, so there's some um, like stretching and a deep tissue massage so that you know, like my muscles will be I, I, uh, I, I, I thought it was like the, it's the Thai massage pala that doesn't have any oils. So you don't mind like having those aromatherapy oils? In the well, I prefer dry massage. A dry. Yeah. But... Interesting, interesting. How about all the other facial treatments? Are you open to that as well? Because, you know, they have the oxygen, they have the vegan. Um, oh, you don't need it, actually. That's the answer. Me no. <laughs> Thanks for being a part Yes, yes, yes. Okay, so how important, again, is the same question, is relaxation into your um, daily uh, Habits. Well, of course, it's super important because you know, I'm, you know, I'm, I'm super busy, and uh, I think uh, we all need uh, time to you know, like relax, like give ourselves, you know, parang a moment na just for us. Because when, you, when you're having a massage, parang, it's just you eh, and, uh, and the massage therapist. So yeah, so I, I 
Well, um, you know, like everyone else, uh, the pandemic has really, um, you know, changed and hopefully we all have uh, grown as a person. What can you say are maybe the three things that you, you have learned the most about going through a pandemic and, you know, life-altering changes? Well, Shiguro, um, the pandemic uh, gave me the time to, like, uh, do the things that I wasn't able to do pre-pandemic, like, uh, studying and uh, I also incorporated you know like meditation so parang before um, I was I was um, I would say like a happy go lucky guy and then like because of the pandemic I learned so much because you know like we're all so bored okay but it gave me the time to like uh, be creative and then you know like the business came up so yeah so good like this um meditation um, Self love and self improvement. Nice, nice. Okay, let's talk about your showbiz career. I hear you're teamed up with Barbie, right? Yeah. But she's not your lover. No, no, no. no. Okay, <laughs> no, no, no. so, yeah, just asking, you know, for a phony question. She's pretty. Yes, I know. How do you not get attracted to her? I mean, no, sorry. My question is how do you show that emotion of passion and love when you're not doing it? Or it's like, it's really acting, or do you need to prepare, or... And why are you not with her? Because she's with someone. Yeah, she's with someone. If she wasn't with someone, would you go out with her? Um, well, she checks all the boxes. Like, she's smart, she's uh, pretty, and uh, she knows what she wants, and she goes after it. And that's what, I, that's what I'm looking for for a girl. <laughs> so in short, yes. Um, good, good, <laughs> Sorry, okay. okay. Uh, are you currently with someone? I don't know. I'm saying. Oh, I'm available. <laughs> so nice. So you're you're looking for a girl that's smart. What did you say again? Uh, just for the audience. Smart, pretty, and uh, knows what she wants and goes after. Wow. We're all passionate girls. Do you prefer a more dominant older woman? <laughs> just kidding. No, I have a question. I have a couple. Okay. Sorry. Would but then you would would you prefer a more um, I know you know equal relationship, but would you prefer a more quiet or a more uh, active, adventurous woman? I would say uh, in the middle, but I'm confident. Ang laki ng playing field pala nito, okay? All girls out there on the video, you have a chance. <laughs> So well, let me ask you also a question five years from now, where do you think you're going to be? Uh, but, uh, with Blue Waters, Papa, and Sam. Oh, sure. <laughs> aside from that, that's already a given, but aside from that. Um, siguro, ano, I see myself um, probably getting married in five years. Wow! Already? How old are you? Do you know that marriage is hard? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no, but it's fun, it's fun. How old are you? I'm 37. Wow. Having one family, you know, so like right now, I'm really um, working on myself for my future. Man, my son is 27. If I went out with you, I'm really going to be a cougar. Okay, would you want to share anything else that I didn't cover? Well, I'm going to thank you so much for being here to all the media, to all the press, and also, of course, to Ms. Nancy, Ms. Mary, my manager, like everyone here. Thank you so much. And to you, Miss. Tessa. Hi. <laughs> Ibigay ng jacket. Okay. Please, may we ask uh, the audience if they have any questions, shoe size, whatever you want. Yes, over here. Please, the mic. Hello, David. I'm Nancy. Hi, Jimmy. Question now, how are you taking all this to sudden, um, sudden fame? Fame, fame. fame. Well, uh, it's honestly a bit um, overwhelming for me because uh, I would I would say that I'm an introverted person, but then you know I'm, I mean I'm, I'm already here, so I'm just taking it day by day, and um, uh, yeah, whatever. So do people stop you on the street now and say, "Yeah, it's actually hard for me to uh, go around." <laughs> Oh, I love it. Anyone else? Hi, David. Um, don't you feel any pressure? <laughs> don't you feel any pressure that uh, uh, since Maria Clara and Barbara uh, is ending now uh, and 
to sustain your the fame or your popularity? Um, I try not to think about it, but then uh, sometimes I ask my manager if um, on next plan and on uh, what we're going to do. Because it's hard to sustain a career like this, and right? I, mean, I don't want to be like a one-hit wonder kind of um, success. So I don't know. I mean, for me, um, as long as um, I still uh, study acting, like I still have to improve on that, and like of course taking care of my body and um, working out and then we just have to wait for the next uh, project or opportunity. Movie? Oh. Why are you surprised that uh, people like you for being, I mean, yung, uh, romantic? Or, like romantic or yung that type? Why are you surprised on that? Um, well, I'm surprised that that's the success of the success of Maria Clara Nibara. Because at the start, I was I was just I was just a supporting character. That was the actually main character, siya. so mas tuno na ako na gulat na parang um, kabaga sobrang tinanggap ng mga tao and like the hype is you know like on very on top talaga. Okay, thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you. Here's Jimmy Anarco. Do you think with the success of Maria Clara, that you have and it's ending the next week? Meron lang po siya sa efforts that she's your projects and next? Or ano na ba yung may isip po next? I think I'm doing uh, teleserie again with, with Barbie. Uh, I, I trust my manager and uh, GME, so... Movies, movies. Uh, ayun, again, meron din kami movies na gagawin ni Barbie for Tessa. Yeah. Are you going to jump into that project again, or are you taking a break first and prepare? I have two days break, uh, starting tomorrow, <laughs> and then after that, balik balik sa trabaho. Siguro nito sa tele series, I would like to have like, uh, like two weeks break, you know. Pero, sure, kung ano yung opportunity, like who am I to say that? Nice. And then uh, the two days break, he was going to check in in blue water. Blue water is Do we have another question? I think over here. Are there? Here, there's a mic. Hi, David. Hello, Um, Do you find a uh, spa dates romantic? And like, meron ka na bang tindi it's not all of that. <laughs> um, yeah, of course, actually, parang, uh, nadala ko na yung, kung ba yung experience ko sa spa and yung mga couple rooms ko sa tab, diba? So, parang romantic, romantic yung gano'n. Tsaka, kung baga, sabay ka nag-relax. Siyempre, mas madalas naman talaga nangyayari yung dinners. So, like, yung spa, like, that's, that's true. Also. So, yeah. And parang earlier you said na, You'll have a two-day break somehow, right? How, how do you plan to spend it? Of course, like, apart from spending as well. I'll spend time with my family and friends. I'm going to a wedding tomorrow. I'm attending my friend's wedding. Then on Sunday, it's your family day on Sunday. This tomorrow, friend's day. Basketball then. <laughs>